Waters running uncontrolled squander the riches of the countryside through which they rush along. Build a wall across the rivers they form, and their potential wealth is imprisoned to good purpose. In South India, the Nizam Sagar Dam across the Manjura River has brought prosperity to many parts of Hyderabad state. The Krishna Raja Sagar Dam on the Kaveri is responsible to a great extent for the progress of Mysore state. The Metro Dam also across the Kaveri has helped to enrich the historic town of Tanjore and the surrounding region. A few hundred miles away from Tanjore flows the Tungabhadra through the remnants of the famous forgotten empire of Vijayanagar, an empire that flourished some four centuries ago. But in the days to come, this deserted land will flourish once more, for the Tungabhadra holds the key to its prosperity. The 1st July 1953, a red-letter day in the achievement of the 400 million rupee Tungabhadra project. Today takes place the opening of one of the canals that leads off from the dam. The honor of ushering the waters into the new canal falls to the oldest inhabitant on hand, a humble peasant who, like so many others, stands to gain much from this giant scheme. He and his kind beseech the deity of the river to bless the project so that prosperity comes to a land long shrouded in drought. Since the dawn of time, the Tungabhadra has run its course through this arid land of scrub and stone. Why has the land then not blossomed into fertility? Herein lies our story. The river gets its name from the confluence of the Tunga and the Bhadra. Their waters mingle near Kudali village, eight miles from Shimoga in Mysore state. Tunga and the Bhadra are fed by the copious rains of the southwest monsoon. But only a modicum of these abundant waters was ever utilized in the plains, where the rains average only 20 inches annually. In the 19th century, famine occurred 10 times in this area while from 1900 to 1940, eight famines have been recorded. These manifestations of misery are due to a lack of rainfall and a lack of opportunity to tap the river waters. The people suffered in Ryosema because of the water shortage. Many migrated when faced with drought and death. For the past 100 years, scheme after scheme has been proposed to save Rio Sima from the water shortage. Bellari district in Mysore state, Raichur district in Hyderabad state, and Anantapur, Kadapa, and Karnul in Andhra have repeatedly suffered from drought. The present project was evolved in 1944 when a provisional agreement was reached between the governments of Hyderabad and the composite state of Madras. The Tungabhadra Dam is located at Malapuram, three miles from the town of Hospet. Here the river cuts through the Sandur Hills. The dam has closed the gap. Built of masonry, it is 6,007 feet long and at the lowest foundations, 160 feet high. Besides the dam, this multi-purpose project consists of two canals. The one on the Andhra Mysore side, 217 miles long, will irrigate about 250,000 acres. The other in Hyderabad and 127 miles long will irrigate 570,000 acres. 